Hi, it's Alex from Serious Heroes and welcome to part 7 of our vlog. It's the first update in two weeks because we've been busy just working and writing new songs and stuff like that. We actually decided we're going to record a couple of songs this fall. We don't know what to do with it yet, but uh, we're going to record them and see what happens. So we've been a band for 10 years this year. We started back in Finspong in 2008 in the basement of my parents' house, which is also the drummer Michael's parents. It was me, Michael, and Marcus on the guitar, and we had a, a bass player called Michael back then. He left after a couple of months to do other stuff, so we brought in Niklas, a classmate of mine, and we started jamming punk rock songs, mostly covers. The same day that we brought Niklas in, a relative to me and Michael called and asked us to play a spot at this punk versus metal thing in Finspong. And his name is Andreas and he plays in a band called JJ and the Crowbars. Great friends of ours, check them out. So he asked us to play at this punk versus metal thing. So And we were so excited because we've been rehearsing for one year, just in the basement, playing covers and trying to write our own songs. And so we said yes, of course, this was in 2009. Michael the drummer was turning 16. Marcus was 20 and Nicholas was 18 like me. Since Finspring is a small city, we don't have much venues, so sometimes you need to combine punk shows and metal shows. So this was, and a way of doing that was making them punk versus metal. We knew all the bands, so it's all friendly. We were told that we're going to play the last slot, so I was figuring maybe like 10 or 20 people would still be there. And I was so nervous and I was really sick and my throat was so sore because I, we'd been practicing like crazy for our first show. And we were getting ready to do the show and the other bands played great. It was uh, a lot of people there actually. But I didn't think anyone would stick around until our show. But then we hit the stage and we could see like maybe 100 or 150 people just crammed in that small place called Rock Bageriet. And it was such an adrenaline rush. We knew everyone in the audience, of course, but uh, since that day we were hooked. This is our first band. We don't have like five or six years in another band before this. So we've learned all, everything we've learned about playing music is from this band. And now, of course we have Daniel with us on bass guitar since 2015. And we don't have any footage from the first show. You gotta fight for the things you believe in. show you some stuff from the rehearsal space where we're trying out a new idea of a song and we're just fooling around having fun but maybe the first or second time we try this song so uh, be nice it's time for some sunday rehearsal and to write some new songs today we're gonna work on songs that we already written Yeah. 